is a women's bantamweight matchup between Ronda Rousey and Holly Holm. All right, almost ready to go with this one. Here is tonight's tale of the tape. Rousey is 28, Holm is 36. The rest of the numbers are close. We set it inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, her team. is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Prudential Center in Newark, New Jersey. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC featherweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This woman is a boxer, holding a professional record of 12 wins, four losses. She stands 5 feet 8 inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Fighting out of Albuquerque, New Mexico, Holly, the preacher's daughter! Oh! And now it's missing her opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This woman is a judo fighter, holding a professional record of 12 wins, no losses. She stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Fighting out of Venice Beach, California, presenting the former UFC women's bantamweight champion of the world, You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. You will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. This has been one of the most highly anticipated matchups for a long time. And ladies and gentlemen, strap yourselves in because it's about to go down right now. All right, we are underway here from Prudential Center in Newark, New Jersey. Well, you can hear from her fans as Ronda Rousey makes her return here tonight. Nine career wins by submission. Eight of her 12 pro wins have ended in round one via submission due to the arm bar. We'll see how Rousey approaches this. Ronda's in trouble. Ronda's in trouble. Ronda's in trouble. Nasty combinations here. Just out of range with that right hand. Oh, this could be it right here. She's walking Ronda down. Oh! Trying to stay in this fight. Oh, she's got double underhooks. Cannot get it. Double underhooks in the clinch. Holmes got the tie clinch now. Very nice. Rousey gets caught with that punch. That knee might have landed there. Tie clinch for her here. We'll see what she can do with it. Rousey gets tattooed by a solid uppercut there. Can't take too many more of those. Excellent takedown defense. Well done there, she pummels. Now she's got double underhooks. First takedown attempt is there. Moves to north-south. Well, hard to win fights in mixed martial arts from the bottom, but nice work here in that position by Holm. Trying to stay heavy here as best she can. She's attempting a submission here. She's got that arm bar locked up. That is just amazing technique. And this might just be a matter of time. Oh, and there it is. A beautiful job in setting up this arm bar. Excellent technique. 
Yeah, near perfection for her in terms of the execution of that arm bar. She worked to isolate the arm, eventually secured it, and the tap came shortly thereafter. So a big win, and it goes in the books by way of the arm bar here tonight. And here's the end of the fight. And one more time from this angle, we can see that arm bar locked in tight for the tap. And let's watch it here one more time. Deep submission and the tap. So that win by submission figures to silence any remaining doubters. And that certainly puts the rest of the division on notice. Huge result for her here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop to this contest at three minutes, 51 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by tap out. Rousey. All right, so another seminal moment in a career full of them for Ronda Rousey here tonight. She continues the celebration there with her corner, and why not enjoy it? Certainly returning to dominant form here tonight. And I think you can say now she's only getting better at this stage of her career. That is a scary proposition for the rest of this bantamweight division.